Welcome to ESPN's Rivalry Week, presented by Pontiac, celebrating 20 years of college football. Tonight, the Alabama Crimson Tide takes on the Auburn Tigers. Great anticipation, as always, for the Iron Bowl. From an eye formation, Williams, five, breaks it out, has ten, he's loose. They go, set the draw up. Alabama really rushes upfield. Carnell Williams breaks the outside. And you think about the embattled coach and the players wanting to get out in this field to play for their coach. They made a statement on the first play. Mike, let's give credit to a number of people, but Monrico Crittenden threw a key block to help Springy. yards on that pass play and here comes Cadillac Williams right side turning those legs inside the 10 and Daniels five catches 52 yards he's the leading receiver tonight Cadillac banging away across the 40 to the 43 it's Wallace the tight end in motion but he goes with Cadillac and he run it back into the boundary cuts it back up he'll have the first down if he comes back possibly would transfer. Cadillac's got 100 yards in 12 carries. Make it 110. Make it almost 115. Now, they lost the best blocker they have, Brandon Johnson. Jake Slaughter, as you said, Ron, stepping in there, doing a pretty good job. Pulling for Washington State, particularly. Running play, and Williams breaks it loose at the 40 and finally pushed out of bounds at the 45. He gets his legs turning now, number 24, Carnell Williams. Watch when he hits this hole. Those legs are moving. Williams again. Nothing to the right side. Bounces it back into the middle. And look at this guy. He winds up with an eight-yard gain. And most backs would have stayed on the right side and been tackled for no gain. And making moves. He cuts back. He gets the ball all the way to the right side. Second down. You can see how short the yardage is. The yellow line just inside the 45. And Cadillac hurdles the man. Has the first down. Cooper Wallace is tight end. From the 16-yard line, Cadillac Williams fighting a gain of almost 10 yards in the play. Trying to settle things down offensively. <laughs> and they'll give it to Cardell Williams. Turns it up. Spin move inside the 30. Slaughter the fullback. Out front blocking. Gets his block. Cadillac scores it. Touchdown order. Auburn 28, Alabama 16. As you see, Slaughter with the block, Cadillac hurdles, and the Auburn Tigers now have moved out to a 12-point margin. We'll be right back. But Auburn retrieved what had been there early, and this guy right here played a major part. Robinson has got a tee just the way he wants it, and here's the onside kick. Recovered by Alabama, but a flag Touch. is down and touched by Alabama before it was 10 yards. We had encroachment against the kicking team on the kickoff. That penalty was declined because we had illegal touching. The ball had not yet gone 10 yards when the kicking team touched it. It was the Auburn's ball, first and two. Tonight, our player of the game brought to you by Russell Athletic is Carnell Cadillac Williams. Had his best evening of the year. 26 rushes, 204 yards. 7.8 his average and two touchdowns. I want to tell you, Cadillac had eight games of 150 yards plus this year. And that ties Bo Jackson and also James Brooks. Some pretty good company yeah. there, huh? Two great players.
You know, that chant will go on into the night. It's great to be an Auburn Tiger. He'll take a knee, and that'll do it. That'll be the final play of this year's Iron Bowl.